Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Sorry, the volume was really loud in my ear, I had to fix that. Um, hi, welcome back to my channel. My boyfriend just got home, so he's probably gonna interrupt. Maybe not. Okay. Anyways, welcome back to my channel. Um, I do want to say I have not filmed a video in like over two weeks. Um, I actually went on a vacation. I was out of my house for like nine days. Like I was gone for a really long time. Um, and then obviously a couple days before I didn't do any filming because I was preparing for the trip. And then a couple days after I was like getting back into being home. So I haven't like even touched the sims in almost two weeks i did play my personal game a little bit last night but um yeah i haven't filmed in like two weeks um that's why videos were very sparse the last two weeks um and then what else was i gonna say i had something else to say i don't know um i don't like fully remember what's going on i do kind of remember because i started writing down what i'm gonna do every day but um basically the kids are over at kennedy and dustin's house today um, oh yeah, and Kennedy is pregnant again for the fourth time. She's pregnant for the fourth time, but she is not going to keep this baby. Um, if you guys remember, I don't know if it was the last part or a couple parts ago, but Dustin proposed to her and she said no, which really put a strain on their relationship. She wants to break up with him, but he wants to marry, well... I thought he wanted to marry her. Maybe he just wants to get married. Um, but yeah, she really wants to break up with him, but she is kind of like, Kennedy's kind of at this point in her life where she's like, I don't really know what to do. I threw away something great with Derek to be with Dustin, and now I don't want to be with Dustin, but I have a baby with him. I'm about to have another one. Um, and Dustin is trying to baby trap her, basically. He is trying to build the life that he wanted with Moira, with Kennedy, and that's just not what Kennedy wants. Kennedy doesn't want to have a family. So she's currently pregnant, but I'm actually going to have her go and become on pregnant. <laughs> um, yeah, so the kids are at, like I said, they're at Kennedy and Dustin's house. Derek and Jen have no kids for the morning, which I'm sure they love. Um, but it is kids switch so after like it's kids switch day so after the kids um have breakfast and everything they will come on over to their house he is just about up so i'm actually gonna have him eat right away um dustin is gonna use the bathroom and kind of like take care of the house a little bit and kennedy i'm gonna send her off right now basically she's telling dustin um she's like you know oh i'm just gonna run upstairs really quick and take care of liam and laney but in reality, she's leaving, and she's going to go get an abortion. I don't know if I can say that word. I don't know if that's going to, like, um, flag my channel. But, yeah, that's what she's going to go do. Arrange surrogate pregnancy. Household is full. Uh, no, it's not. Also, I do need to check their aging. I need to make sure I turn that off. Um, we do have some birthdays coming up. Let's see. Starting on Thursday, we have a birthday every single day for like four days. So yeah, we have a bunch of birthdays coming up. I'm super excited about that. So we're going to send Kennedy out. She's going to like do her thing. And then after that is done, I'm actually, I know I literally just zoomed in. I'm sorry. Um, when she's done with that, I'm going to send her to the spa. Where's the spa? Over here. We're going to send her to the spa and she is going to get a deep tissue massage and then um, a mani-pedi because in her mind, she really needs that. Um, so basically, she is just leaving Dustin with Lainey and Liam. She's leaving him there to do the kid switch. Um, like she is just she's like, I want no part in in the kids anymore. She's like, I'm, I'm done with kids. I never wanted to have kids. I felt like I was baby traps by both men <laughs> yeah um also don't remember if i did this for the last part or not i fully could have and just don't don't remember but i did give derek a makeover he's got a new hairdo he's got a different beard um new clothes again i probably showed this in the last part and i just don't remember and now i'm wondering did i make a new thumbnail i know i was supposed to but like did i do it i don't know i really don't know I really, really don't know. Okay, um, you're just going to go eat breakfast right away because I really wanted you guys to eat breakfast together. I'm going to have her stop for just a second so they can eat together. 
Okay, eat your waffles. That's fine. Oh, that's right. He has to go to school. Okay, so before you go to school, you need to come up here. Um, change her outfit and then feed her on the floor, I guess. That's probably all you're going to have time for. These guys are having a cute little breakfast together, and then I'm going to have him just use the bathroom and then change his clothes, and he will head over to get Lainey because, you know, it is the kid switch. She's getting that procedure done. Oh, she's going to be spending so much money today. 2500 500 and then another 100 So she's spending over $3,000 today. That's insane. Um... Justin, you can come over here and get yourself some breakfast. Eat a mini chocolate gnome. Nice, nutritious breakfast for you. Um, Jen, we're going to let... Dance for... Th no. We're going to let him finish his food, and then we're going to have you dance. Oh, my God. I forgot we had a dog. <laughs> Is that horrible of me? Um, I think that's horrible of me. I totally forgot we had a dog. Love that. You're going to do the dishes, not him. Um, oh, yeah, you need to feed her on the floor really quickly before you run off to school. Oh, not yourself. Okay, put her down. I hate that I can't just, like, say feed on floor. You know what I mean? Okay, feed on floor. And then you need to go to school. If there's school today. For some reason, I felt like maybe there wasn't school today. I don't know. I don't freaking know. Um, all right, and then you're going to walk over here. You are eating. You'll go ahead and do the dishes. So according to, you know, Dustin, Kennedy's just upstairs with the kiddos. That's what Kennedy's doing. Um, oh, did I get you a job? Okay, she's a teacher's aide. What was I going to say about Jen? I know in the last part you guys did give me a skill for her to have, but I forgot what it was. Um, so before I film the next part, I will go back and check. But yeah, I... I will have a skill for her. The baby is gone. Kennedy had a successful on pregnancy. <laughs> oh my God. And then look at this. Now she has this mood lit. Feeling relief. Having a baby is a great responsibility for which Kennedy is not prepared, even though she already has three kids. Oh my gosh, you guys. Craziness. Freaking craziness. What's she doing? She's still drinking her bottle. All right, so she's going to work on her writing, and he is going to head on over. Actually, why don't you give the dog some attention? Why don't you come over here, um, feed her a treat, talk to her a couple times, brush her, and then try and pet her. Lady is bringing in the newspaper, which, like, very kind of you, but I want nothing to do with that. I want nothing to do with that. Um, what's his school like? He knows his uncle. Oh, excuse me. He knows Nancy, Layla. Oh, he knows plenty of people. We're going to talk to friends. Um, he's actually one of the birthdays that is coming shortly, um, which I'm very grateful for. Um, because I, I just feel like it's time for him to become a teenager, you know? All right. So, you need to get over here. Carpool will come for Jen in an hour. Wait, does she work? She does work today. I did not realize that. Okay, she'll spend the day just um, talking to the dog before she goes to school or goes to work. Okay, um, so we're going to come in here and we're going to, I guess, discuss work. You know, this is them trying to make small talk, you know, for the sake of the kids. And Derek's going to be like, oh, you know, where's Kennedy? And he's going to be like, don't worry about it. You know, like, I don't know where she is either, but I'm not telling you that. Okay, so they're just, you know, basic kid things. They're like, oh, how was she today or this week, you know, is everything good? Is she potty trained? She is potty trained. Thank God. Does she know how to walk and talk? She knows how to walk but not talk. So I think that's what we're going to focus on today because he does work. Just kidding. I thought he didn't work today. <clears throat> I think they're actually going to have, like, a positive interaction. Like, I think this is going to be the first positive interaction they've had. Oh, my God. They had a positive interaction. I'm so proud of them, you guys. Like, I'm actually so proud of them. All right. Well, why don't you go get your other son? Um, let's come over here. Oops. 
play with him, snuggle him, and he just shit his pants, so change his dirty diaper. And he doesn't really need a bottle, but we're going to give him a bottle anyways, um, just because. All right, and then once you pick up Lainey, you are going to run over here with her. She is off to work. I'm going to have her work hard. Um, I really want her to, like, thrive in the education career. I just think it'd be really good for her. Let me see. Does she have enough points? Probably not. I, like, never use lifetime rewards. If there's any lifetime rewards you want me to buy for people, just let me know. Like, I literally never, ever use them. Um, I know there's, I know I can, like, cheat it by taking her into create a sim, but I really don't want to do that. I know there's a way that I can, like, change her lifetime wish through this. Mmm... I did not think it was going to be this expensive, though. I don't know. I couldn't find it, so whatever. Not a big deal. Um, all right, lady, why don't you go ahead and pee, and then where's that ball you were headed for? Probably this one. Okay. And then are you back over here? Not quite yet. Um, oh, oh, stop, stop, stop. Okay. <clears throat> No, do not dance. We're going to go ahead and put Chad in his crib. And then he's going to work from home because, I mean, that's what he does. Um, are you off to work yet? Go to work. You don't leave until noon. Okay. Wait, does he actually... Does everybody work today? For some reason, I thought nobody works today. Like, I don't know. I don't know. Um, so I guess when Dustin gets home from work, that's when him and Kennedy are going to have that little uh, little moment. Um, and actually, we're going to come upstairs with her. So that way, um, when he goes to work, she's like up there with her high chair and everything. Um, and we're going to do as much teaching her to talk as we can until he has to go to work because he does have to go to work fairly soon. And I don't know if we've even started teaching her to talk. And she ages up soon-ish. She's supposed to age up on Saturday. Well, no, okay, she's got time. Never mind. It's not as close as I thought. And we haven't even started, so it's okay. It's all right. We've got time. Um, okay, so... Actually, you know what? Kennedy's going to be home soon. I was going to say that I would pick up later, but Kennedy's going to be home soon, so I will just pick up when Kennedy gets here. We are unfortunately going to have to get a babysitter because Kennedy will not be home by noon when both the boys have to leave for work, but that's totally fine, totally understandable. All right, you need to go to work, you need to go to work, and then you need to use this, and I want to start working on your skills. I don't know where you're at with that. Chad is doing great, and Kennedy is on her way home, so we'll just see her when she gets home. Maybe she'll beat the boys here. Who knows? Or maybe she'll get here before the boys leave, I guess, is more so what I'm trying to say. Probably not, though. Look at this. Look at his fancy carpool car, and then look at Derek's. So different. They're so freaking different. Yes, I know. We're coming. Relax. He's level 10, isn't he? Yes, he's level 10. I'm going to have him just chill at the water cooler. He can do whatever the hell he wants, honestly. No babysitter? Um, I have a toddler and a baby at home by themselves, and you're telling me I didn't need a babysitter? Is it because Kennedy's on her way home? I don't know. That just seems a little weird to me. I don't know. Just saying. Um, <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, okay, I want to make sure I get everything done that I wanted to get done. So the rest of it is going to have... He works one to four. Are you serious? I wish I had that schedule. Okay, and all of this is done for you. So you need to make sure you come to the correct house. And you're going to eat some grilled cheese. You know, she's feeling good. She got rid of the baby. Um, her two older kids are not with her right now. You know, she's doing good. She's doing great. She loves her life right now. Live, laugh, love. <laughs> I'm so stupid. I don't know why I said that. 
Um, yeah, so basically we're just waiting for Dustin to get home because that's when a bunch of the drama is going to go down. And you know Kennedy, she she is not going to do her own dishes. Absolutely not. We're going to go ahead and start painting. Um, Liam should be home from school and lucky for him, he gets to go home to Derek's house instead of Kennedy's house. Jen, what time do you get off? She works till 4.30. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. Um, I love how Lainey is technically home alone right now. That's great. We love that for her. Um, we'll just pretend that Kennedy is watching her until um, I think Jen gets home first. Yeah, we'll just pretend that Kennedy is watching Lainey until Jen gets home. Oh my gosh, I love that. She's just like leaving her alone. Oh, excuse me. And actually, we're going to go take a nap because, like I said, a lot's going to happen when Dustin um, gets home from work. And I want to check his relationships really quickly. Um, granddaughter. Grandson. Old enemies. Okay. And his son is his current enemy. Love that. Liam got a souvenir from his trip, and he had a great time. He's on his way home. Lady, how are you doing? Let's have you come inside and get some food and chew on a toy or something. Um, we're going to go ahead and eat from bowl and then chew on this. And I'm going to throw this away because that's disgusting. We did not want her. Oh. Okay. I really should just cancel the newspaper service because I never use it, but it's just like something in my heart, man. Like, my heart will not let me cancel it. I don't know why. It's so weird. Okay. Liam. Lead a field trip at Science Facility this weekend. Of course. She would love to. Wait, what's going on this weekend? Maybe I should have checked that before I... Um, ooh, okay. I don't know if that's going to happen, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. All right. Please tell me you're coming to the correct house. Yes. Everyone always tries to come to this house first. We are going to have a quick chocolate gnome because he's a little bit hungry and then do our homework. And honestly, I don't see him using this mirror, but I could definitely see Lainey using it. So we'll stick it in Lainey's room. He'll, it'll be like his gift to her. Um, and then... Let's take this. Can I put it up here? We'll put that there. Cute. All right, so he's going to grab some food, do his homework. He's almost home, and the drama is about to begin. I'm so excited, you guys. I'm so freaking excited. Um, and you are already done with that, so that whole time has been a waste of time, but it's fine. It's totally fine. Um, Jen earned 138. Oh, God. I always hate that. I need to I need to learn how to catch that faster. Okay, so we are going to run over to this house. She's going to wake up from her nap. Let's have you change your clothes really quickly and then come over here. <clears throat> okay, so he like hears a commotion in the bedroom. So he's actually going to run into the bedroom. He's like, oh my God, she's finally home. I thought Chad was with a babysitter all day. Um, so he is going to argue with her. Basically, he's like, you know, where have you been? You, you lied to me. You told me you were with the other kids and then you just left the house and I haven't seen you all day and I didn't know where you were and I had to go to work. So he's going to argue with her. He's very upset with her right now. All right, you're still working. Are you home? You are home. Let's have you go take care of Lainey just a little bit. We're going to have you come upstairs. Um, you're going to snuggle her, tickle her, and then feed her in the high chair because she is just a little bit hungry. So let's go back to these guys. Actually, what's your relationship like with the kids? I want you guys to be friends eventually. They're getting there. Okay, it's not bad. It's not too bad. Okay, so then they're arguing, so then she's going to be like, well, <sighs> um, she's going to argue back and she's going to be like, well, you should know that I was pregnant this morning and now I'm not. And it's both of those are your fault. Sorry, I need to drink my coffee. So now he's 
pissed. He's like, that was my child. You should have asked me. Um, he's going to insult her and accuse her of being a diva. Are they supposed to break up today or do they break up a different day? Okay, I know what day they break up. Yeah, so he's like, you're just a little diva. You think the world revolves around you. Like, I should have had a say too, blah, blah, blah. So they're just really, really upset. So Kennedy is like, you know what? I don't need this. I'm leaving. And she's going to be gone for a long time. Um, she's going to be gone for a while. Let's go down. I want to find a place that's open until like 4 a.m. I think two might be the best. Oh, here we go. We're going to go to the Wild Goose. It's open till 4 a.m. She's going to leave. She's like, I'm done with this. I don't need you. You're treating me horribly. Oh, he has that same mood lit. Except he's not actually... We'll just pretend his is negative. <laughs> we'll just pretend that he's, like, pissed about it. Okay? <laughs> All right. So he's going to come over here to his remaining child. And he's going to give him some attention. Hello? Um... Yeah, we can do that. He's going to give him some attention. You know, he's going to be like, oh my gosh, like, at least I still have you. I'm so thankful. I don't know what I'd do without you. Your mother's a whore. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. But actually, he probably would say that stuff. Ooh, my knee itches. Okay. Oh, you know what? So I only have stuff through Sunday planned, but... Or like birthdays through Sunday, but there's definitely more birthdays that need to be had shortly after that. So, oh my God, stop doing that! He does that every time. Yeah, you made your son cry. How do you feel about that? And then give him a bottle. Did you feed her? Okay, she's currently eating. Um, while you wait for her to finish eating, um, give Lady some attention. How close are you and Lady? I don't think, like, close at all, to be honest. She's probably not going to let you pet her, but we'll see. Oh, all right, she ran away. It's fine. It's totally fine. Um, we're going to go ahead and let Lainey out. And what is there to eat? Let's have some shawarma and then take a quick shower. He is just about home. Um, he's going to have a grilled cheese, and then I think he's going to spend the rest of the night up with Lainey trying to teach her um, how to talk. Um, teach to talk. Set her down, please. Set her down, please. This is taking too long. All right, so then you'll go use the potty. And then you're going to come right back in here. Oh. You must have changed his diaper before it was ready. My bad. Change his dirty diaper, give him, or put him in his crib. You are going to eat some cake and then work from home until you need to go to bed. Like, that's the rest of his day. Um, she is going to be at the club all night long. She's not going to come home. She's going to sleep at the club. Like, she is, literally, she's not coming home. All right, and you, oh, I want you to answer your phone, actually, because it might be Moira. We haven't seen her in a while. I've been meaning to, like, invite her over, um, but then all this stuff has been happening. Like, all this drama, and Moira's trying to stay out of the drama. Girl, we are in a happy relationship, okay? Um, no. No. All right, so we are going to teach her how to talk until she's tired, put her to bed, take a shower, and then probably go to bed ourselves. I'm just kind of trying to get everyone, like, set up for the day. Let's come in here and take a bubble bath. Actually, hold on. You need to go here, and you need to go here, because I need the bathroom open so Liam can take a bubble bath. Okay. All right, teach her how to talk. Now I have to re-scan, re-scan, re-put everything in, take a shower. If you don't do it after, you need to do the dishes and then continue working on your book. 
You're eating, working from home. Okay, they're all good. So let's jump over to Kennedy because I kind of want Kennedy to, like, sleep with somebody, (laughs) to be honest. Like, I want her... Honestly, like, what's Alex up to? You guys remember Alex? She had a thing with her in high... Look, Alex is her closest relationship. How embarrassing. How freaking... She's at an outdoor club in the pouring rain. How embarrassing. Girl, you're embarrassing. You're so embarrassing. And the only person here celebrating with you is this dog. Is this somebody's dog or is this a stray? It's somebody's dog. Love that for them. Um, Yeah, answer the phone. Maybe someone will ask you to, like, go on a date. (laughs) Maybe it'll be for a date. Who knows? Let's try her out. Girl, answer your phone. What's taking so long? Hogan Hoff. Hell yeah, Hogan. Here we go. We're going on a date. (laughs) She doesn't even know this man. Never heard that name before in my life. But she is so mad at her boyfriend. So off she goes. Oh my gosh. Kennedy, you have ruined your life. Oh my god, he's an old man. It's another old man. <laughs> um, you know what? When in Rome, she's already dating an old man, so why not? Maybe this old man won't want kids. <laughs> um, why does he look short, too? Is it a teenager with gray hair? It's a fucking high schooler. (laughs) Oh my god. It's a high schooler with gray hair. Um. Wow. Oh my god. And a zebra horse. It's a fucking high schooler with gray hair. You know what? I could see Kennedy doing it. I could. I could see her being like... 29, dating a 17-year-old, thinking that she's hot shit, you know, and it's cool. Um, Let's flirt with him. Let's just go straight into flirting and see what he does. Bitch, you asked me on a date. You have a girlfriend. (laughs) Okay, so why did you ask me on a date? Why can't I, like, go into the bar? Okay, here we go. Um, Preston, you're probably a high schooler too. You just look like, oh, never mind. Not when you rendered. Okay, let's come over here and play this with him just to get him like in the bar. Um, what happened to her energy? What? I'm confused. Was she not exhausted? I don't know. Um, Also, just wanted to let you guys know, I got everybody set up with stuff to, like, get them through until bed. He's actually going to go to bed because he has school tomorrow. I'm going to keep you up just a little bit later. Um, And then I'm going to wait. She's actually tired. So let's, yeah, put her to bed. Okay. So let's stop this. Um, Ask his sign. Let's ask about his career. Ask about his age. Not that she cares. No, do not invite him. Can you imagine? She shows up at the house with a teenage boy. She's like, hey. She's like one extreme to the next. An old grandpa to a high schooler. Oh my god, I was inside the vents. Did you guys see that? I'm inside the vents. I don't know why that's so cool to me, but I'm inside the vents. Okay, anyways. Um, They have compatible signs. Cool. That's good. It'll get their relationship up a lot quicker, so then she can woohoo with him. Um, I really want... What happened to her? Like, she was dead tired. What happened? I'm so confused. Anyways, it doesn't matter. It's also midnight, and this kid is... Oh, shoot. You need to go to bed. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. You're showering, going to bed. You're good. You're good. I'm just going to drag his energy down so he sleeps through the night. Ten days. Oh, that's right. I have aging turned off. Hello. I did it once before. Maybe I didn't. Testing cheats enabled. True. Drag this down so you just sleep. 
Okay, perfect. They're friends. All right. Um, sorry, this is probably gonna be a super long video. Um, I really just want to get her like cheating with this teenager. <laughs> Oh my god, Kennedy is so freaking problematic. I cannot. All right, you know what? Heat of the moment kiss. Honestly, this is a better story. She's trying to cheat and she keeps getting rejected. <gasps> I did not expect that. I did not expect that one bit. Oh, it's because he's a party animal. I don't think party animals are able to even turn that down. Um, okay, let's try and kiss him. See, now he's, like, feeling it. Oh, see, now he wants nothing to do with it. Like, what? Oh, my gosh. Um, is there anywhere for them to woohoo on this lot? There is not. So, I am going to buy a photo booth. I do this quite a bit, um, just because I hate when, um... I hate when there's nowhere to woohoo on a lot. Like, it's just super annoying to me. At one point, I did have some mod in my game that you could woohoo in, like, these toilets. But either it, like, got deleted or lost or, like, it never actually worked. But does anyone remember that mod? Does anyone know what I'm talking about? Um, I hope somebody does. All right, we're going to put that there. Oh, excuse me. And then I'm just going to cheat 2,000 Smolians back into the family funds because realistically we would not have bought that for here you know what i mean so let's go ahead and woohoo with hogan and then i'm gonna call it um call it a day this part i've been recording for literally 34 minutes so this part's probably like pushing 30 minutes if not over 30 minutes already um so we're just gonna have a quick woohoo and then um kennedy is gonna stay out all night she is not gonna go home tonight um, she is going to get kicked out of the bar here in about 50 sim minutes, but she definitely ain't going home. Um, and she's sleeping with a teenager, which could literally get her arrested. I wonder if there's like a get arrested mod. Because the only way you can get arrested is in the, um, in the criminal career. But I wonder if... I'm going to look into that. <laughs> I'm going to look in to see if you can get... Like there's an arresting mod um, because I kind of want that. I really want that. Honestly, okay, side note, there are so many amazing mods that I've thought about putting into my game, but because I make Let's Plays, I don't want to make it too far out from what The Sims actually is, you know what I mean? Um, so let me know what you guys think about that. Do you want me like to get these mods that make things more realistic, or do you want me to keep it, you know, kind of like The Sims? Um, anyways, Kennedy just woohooed in a photo booth with a teenager at two in the morning on a Wednesday. Girl, you is grown. You are a grown ass woman, and you just did that. Like that's disgusting. Um, your son's literally almost a teenager. But I'm gonna go ahead and end this part here. I hope you guys did enjoy. I'm really having fun with this, so I think I'm gonna film the next part right away. The next part isn't gonna be quite as juicy as, you know, becoming unpregnant and fighting with your boyfriend and then cheating on him with the high schooler. Um, but it's still gonna have some like pizzazz to it. So if you guys did enjoy this part, make sure you let me know by giving it a thumbs up, commenting down below, and subscribing. And I will see your lovely, lovely faces in my next one. Bye, guys.